my beautiful and amazing crafters welcome to another video of crafting with Shanita in today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to make your own QR code with your logo right in Canva I do have Canva Pro so I'm going to be showing you how I created this design using the elements I found in the elements tab but Canva does have amazing free elements as well so let me just scoot in just a little bit so you can see that I created a QR code and I included my little logo in the middle of the code and I did scan it with my phone's camera and it took me directly to the link so let's get started now for the size of the page um, any size would be fine I have a template page that I use to create all of my designs so I don't have so many different folders and um, pages so I'm just going to go off of a template size of 8 by 5 by 11 but again any size would do. Let's go ahead and create a new page and let's start with creating our QR code. So on the side tab, we're going to find the QR code generator. You could click on apps, search Canva apps, and just type in QR code and it should populate QR code generator. There are a few different QR code generators available. We're going to use this one right here. Once it generates, it's going to ask you to enter your URL link and then it will generate the code. Here you could put your business link. I went ahead for fun and just put the Canva link so it could generate a QR code. And let's try it on my mobile device to see if it works. Perfect. How easy was that? Now let's jazz it up a little bit with some elements. So I'm going to go to my elements tab and I'm going to type in QR code. And this would generate some really cute scam me elements that you can use, or you can even create your own. Let's filter it out by free elements, see what's available. And now I'm gonna go back and filter it by pro elements since I have Canva Pro. I like this one. I'm gonna go ahead and size it so it fits over my QR code. Group it and resize the design. You change the color. I change the colors to add to match my branding colors. Now I'm going to add the Canva logo right here in the center since this is just for tutorial purposes and this is the Canva link. So I'm going to go back to Elements and get Canva. I'm going to test it one more time just to make sure that the Canva logo does not interfere with the QR code. Perfect, it works. Now you could go ahead and save this as 
a PNG and maybe bring it into your cut it, cutting design software, maybe make an offset and make stickers or cards. You can sublimate it onto um, some keychains. The sky is the limit. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's tutorial. I hope you learned a little or a lot. And I will see you on the next video of Crafting with Shanita. Happy crafting!